Pro-Trump rally and BLM rally clashed in Bend today. No arrests were made, but Bend police were called to the scene when tensions rose. Jordan Williams has the details. I've actually never been to a type of protest like this before where it would start off as like a Trump protest and then it sort of half and half split through this invisible line. What simply started as a man selling Trump merchandise quickly turned to a two-sided rally between Trump and Black Lives Matter supporters. And uh, my intent was never to create any commotion or anything. I had no idea it was like this down here in Central Oregon. On Thursday morning, Stuart P. from Washington began selling Trump flags, hats, and shirts in the Safeway parking lot located on Ben's 3rd Street. Uh, our intent was just to offer people who are supportive of Trump uh, an opportunity maybe to buy some flags or things that paraphernalia that they might be able to show with pride. About an hour later, Black Lives Matter supporters showed up and began selling their own merchandise. Luke Richter, the president of the Central Oregon Peacekeeper, said the issue began because the Trump merchandise was being sold on Safeway's property. Richter said a week earlier, the Central Oregon Peacekeepers were kicked off the property for gathering donations for fire evacuees. Eventually, the Trump booth was moved to the sidewalk and Ben police were called to the scene to keep the peace. Everybody has a right to protest, but when you get violent and nasty, there's no need. We didn't step over or say anything to them until they started talking to us. Nancy, a Navy veteran and BLM supporter, says she had an encouraging conversation with a fellow veteran who is a Trump supporter. Nancy says finding common ground and unity is the number one goal in a tense time like this. I mean, I always hold on to hope that we can, we can uh, bridge that division, but it's just, it's hard. It's really hard. In Bend, Gordon Williams, News Channel 21.